So I decided to look into the, the efficacy of visible body because of what I saw in my classes. I saw so much improvement in students and I wondered if it was just me <laughs> or if other people were, were experiencing similar things with, with this product. But we surveyed five different institutions. The class sizes ranged from 20 students to 200. Um, so big range. And what we really looked for is sites where there was not a lot of change in grading. The only change I wanted was the use of visible body. The majority of the majors of students that were represented by this study were nursing students. And the ones that weren't nursing students were interested in other health fields. So you've got a smaller portion of STEM students that's very typical of A&P courses. Um, the majority of the students were also freshmen, followed up by sophomores, so very early in their academic career. These are the students that typically need the most help. We got grade data, and all these are is the end of semester grades of the students um, who either were in a semester that didn't use visible body or semester that did, it's the same instructor for both semesters and the same schools for both semesters. So the only switch is that visible body, whether or not it was used. And what I want you to see is in blue here, we have the percent of students with a given final grade. Now the things to pay attention to are right here we have a decrease in grades below 50. So the students are not getting those grades. And if you look here where the bars are getting a little higher, we've got a lot more students up in that A range, 90 and above. So those bars are much bigger than they were in the non-visible non body semesters. Um, this shift is actually statistically significant, which is kind of exciting. Um, although here it should be noted that we're looking at aggregate data. What that means is that we just took the grades from everybody and we kind of threw them all in a pool rather than analyzing class by class. Um, you'll notice the median grade without visible body is just below 80%, which is actually pretty great, I think. Um, but then when you put visible body in there, now your median grade is in the mid 80s which is actually astounding. That means, you know, the majority of your students are, are Bs. That's fantastic. One of the questions on our survey was, what are your cutoffs for A, B, C, D, F? Um, and how many students withdrew from your course? This creates what I call the visible body effect. The visible body effect is I look at the percentage of students in each of those categories with visible body and I subtract the without visible body. And that allows me to see what change was created in theory by visible body. Of course, you can have some change in the students from year to year. Um, but by doing multiple sites, we kind of hopefully wash some of that out. So you'll notice here, this is our increase in A's um, at some institutions. In fact, the, the average difference was around 20%, which is absolutely staggering. My students that have used this product have said this is great because it's on my phone. I can use it during the lunch break. I can use it on my bus commute. I can use it. One of them was a boiler technician and he would use it while the boilers were emptying and refilling. So you had these down periods at work and it allows them to study in much smaller snippets. And I'm not going to bore you with the details, but it turns out that everything we know about human learning is that you are better off in smaller snippets. Your attention span is actually very short. It's 15 minutes or less. So if you're studying in 15 minute chunks, you're probably going to retain a little bit more. Teaching enjoyability. So this is just the instructor having more fun teaching. They rated it at a 4.8. So they really love to use it. Um, and I would agree with that. I don't use slides anymore. Now I, I project the models and I actually talk to my students and it is this wonderful, beautiful thing. Teaching ease is again about a 4.8. So they say it's much easier to use than a traditional textbook. The best parts of this, the students are more engaged, they're performing better, it's easier for the instructor and we can actually look at the grade data and we can say, yes, the students are legitimately performing better and we're retaining more in the course.